yes hello everyone uh, so now we are dealing with layers of the solid works so now if you want to create the layers in the drawings what you need to do you need to activate the layers first so for that you just right click on this and select the tools from here select this layer this one option um, from tools you can select the layers otherwise you can search from here go with the layers so when you do this so if you want to add the layers for the first select this layer properties from here click on new option to add the new layers so let me select dimension for now okay so for that i'm going to change the color of this as blue so let me go with this blue and in the style let it be the same and uh, everything is fine so it's okay so next i want to add, create one more layer so in this i am going to mention as text okay for now it is text so for the text i am going to change the color as red So if center line is there, I can go with center line. So let me go with center line. So for that, I'm going to use the color as blue and the thickness is same. And here I'm spe I will specify this as a center style. So after creating all the layers, just click OK. Now, so I want to change the layers for all the dimensions. So I'll just select this all like this. And I'll uncheck what and all I don't want. So I don't want these texts should be there in my dimensions. Okay. So now I will activate dimension layer you can see all the dimensions turn into blue so next again i will select each and everything instead of that i will go with manual selection because already dimension also gets selects so i know that i'm just going to select these texts and for that text i'm going to assign the layer as text So next for the center line, so I'm going to create the center line for now. So I'll click on annotation and I will go with center line and I will select this drawing. You can see the center line modification. So this is about layers in SolidWorks. So if you want to change the layers, you can able to just switch back to these layers. So if you want to just hide them, you can go with this hide and show option to just remove these things. So I hope you all understood how to create the lines as well as how to create the layers for each and everything. So I hope this might help you to work on the SOLIDWORKS layers. Thank you for watching.